Hi, welcome to Yomi's Home. We post new videos every Tuesday and sometimes on Thursday. Today, we are so excited because this is our 20,000 subscriber celebration video. Yay! It's also kind of like our YouTube Rewind for 2020. Yeah. <laughs> it fits perfectly together, yeah. Yeah, it really does. Um, so thank you guys so, so much. And if you want to hear us talk about 2020, what the year was like for us, the things that we did, the things that we maybe weren't able to do, um, and all the highlights, then why don't you come on in? Kick off your shoes. And stay a while. We're really, really glad, glad you're here. here. <laughs> Bring it. Dutch word of the day. Dutch word of the day. So normally we choose the Dutch word of the day, but for the first time in Yobi's home history, the Dutch word of the day is uh, by our subscriber Hazard Zero, who left this comment. Thank you. And the way that you say it is gefeliciteerd, which means congratulations. You guys, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for the last like couple of months where we were really trying to reach this goal of 20,000 and we couldn't have done it without you guys. You guys watching, liking, subscribing, sharing our videos, everything that you guys did helped us to get here. And we are just so thankful and so grateful. Um, ultimately 20,000 doesn't really change much for us. It doesn't do anything when you think, why do YouTubers always want these subscribers? It's not about that. It was about 2020 being a shitty year. <laughs> um, and you know, so many goals that we had set for ourselves, we couldn't do because of Vinny. <laughs> because of Vinny. <laughs> because of Vinny. We couldn't do them because I can't film videos because I'm a dog. So many things in 2020 were unachievable for reasons out of our control and out of your control and out of everyone's control. Um, and so being able to set a goal and meet it is the, the, the biggest satisfaction for me. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. Did you have a favorite video in 2020 that we made? Uh, yeah. You mean like favorite to film? Because if you're a favorite to film, then no doubt Carnival oh, in Limburg. It was amazing. Yeah. It was such an incredible experience. Yeah. Yeah. How, what, definitely a strong highlight of 2020. Yeah. And also now that you think about it, like we, we enjoyed it like on our max, but like still how much we took for granted there, because this was days before like Corona just went all wow, here in the Netherlands, like days. And we just were in crowded squares, like bunch of people, like old people, young people, everyone together. Like if we, you, you can't even imagine that now and how much we took that for granted still. Yeah. <laughs> and so, so naive in our, in our time. But yeah. yeah, it was really just so fun. Yeah, definitely. Um, although I have to say, when we did our Homeland series, we did so many fun things. Like definitely, yeah. That was my favorite series to film. Yeah, for sure. Like we did the New Year's Dog, New New Year's Dog. Yeah. In January. <laughs> in February we did Carnival. In March we did nothing. <laughs> in April we did nothing. In May. I went on a bike for the first time in like six, seven years. <laughs> yeah. In June, we went to the Open Dutch Museum. Yeah. In July, we... We went to Groningen. That was so fun. Definitely. That, <gasps> Groningen, what a city. And I, I learned about Hofjes. Yeah. <laughs> that was amazing. And then August, Friesland. We snuggled cows. We snuggled cows. <laughs> I mean, what a trip. You know, like when we went, like we saw snake and we drank that fun, but like delicious beer. Well, I, I drank the beer. <laughs> he did not drink the beer. We, I mean, like, yeah. And then in, in September, Nord Brabant. Yeah. And we did indoor skydiving. <laughs> <laughs> we did so much fun stuff. I just almost forgot that. Like the most amazing experience ever. Like, Yeah. But I think, you know, part of the thing is like the year was so, there were moments of the year that when the things were closed and it was just so heavy and so hard, but it, I think reviewing like this or thinking about the things that we actually did do, like we realized like 
we actually like did some stuff like yeah that's really nice i love the homeland series so so much yeah <laughs> yeah i can't wait to finish it i wish we could have finished it in 2020 like the way that we planned it yeah one province a month for 12 months and we do the whole of the netherlands but we did seven yeah which leaves us five for 2021 hopefully i mean hopefully right yeah <laughs> what else can we say now 2020 what was your highlights i mean there were some highlights, but I think that the thing that I'm the most proud of was getting my A2 levels of in course. Dutch. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was so cool. And it was unexpected because as I mentioned in the Yovi Goes Dutch series, I don't know if you guys saw it, I was talking about how I hadn't planned to do this until next year when my daughter actually starts going to school full time. But this year she started going to Pinterest Spills all for a few hours every morning. Um, and with my husband being like working from home because of Corona, he was able to pick her up from Poetry Spells All, which allowed me the space that I needed to actually do school. And so it was really amazing to go and freaking finally learn Dutch. So yeah, and yeah, that was definitely one of my moments. So yeah, that was 2020. Yeah. Moving on. <laughs> Moving on to 2021, let's look forward. Are we gonna make some changes to this channel? Um, yes, but I think we're also going to keep stuff the same. I feel like a lot of people uh, are very inter interested in the, like, the Dutch series and you learning Dutch. Mm -hmm. But I think it's important to mention like we will remain an English-speaking channel. Yes. Yeah. So the reason when we started YouTube and when we started this channel, the goal is to be a resource for people who are moving to the Netherlands or thinking about moving here. Um, and or just moved here and don't know where to find things or how things work. And for that reason, making this channel a content in English is going to be the most helpful to people who don't speak Dutch yet. However, you guys, I am obsessed with speaking Dutch. I love it. So we decided that on Instagram, that content will mostly be Dutch. So yeah. there will be a lot of, I will be making a lot of reels that are gonna be in Dutch or about Dutch language or things like that. So Instagram and TikTok are going to be my Dutch home and YouTube will remain my English home. Yeah. Our English home, I say my, but it's everything is ours. So <laughs> just know that the goal of this channel is to help people who don't know Dutch yet. So just yes. keep that in mind. Yeah, and I think like you already mentioned like feedback, like we, you know, we love like hearing that. And that's why we want to ask you guys something, a favor. Yeah, <laughs> another favor. <laughs> another favor. <laughs> no, uh, yeah. Like when you have a standard job, like you have performance reviews, like someone tells yeah. you once in a while, like how you did, um, and then you know, it's nice for yourself, for your boss, you know, yeah. <laughs> for everyone. I mean, what you're doing well and also where you can grow, what you can improve on, yeah. what people think that you didn't do so well. So, yeah. And we're at a point where we think like, this would be nice for us. Yeah. So we made ourselves a little <laughs> few form. Yeah. It's in the bio. I think one of the first links uh, you will find there is a link to a form with some questions. Just what do you think about the channel? What do you think about us? What do you think about the content we make? We're just really curious. Like we have our numbers, we have our statistics, but like we feel like sometimes we can use like someone actually telling us. Yeah. Yeah. And so feel free to give us constructive feedback. We really Definitely. want to, to use that to improve ourselves. Um, and so if you are interested in helping us out and answering some questions, it's just a Google form. Let us know. We will use that information just to make the channel better. So you guys, thank you so much. This is our 2020 Rewind uh, video. We want to say thank you once again. And thank you well, okay? And hartelijk bedankt. <laughs> yeah, thank you well for the 20,000 volgers. But you told me now, I know now, Dan told me, in mm -hmm. Dutch you don't say 20, 20. Thank you well for 20,000 volgers in 2020. Yes. <laughs> there you go. We really appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for watching, for liking, for sharing, for commenting, and everything else that you've done. Um, and we look forward seeing you in uh, 2021. Be safe tonight. <laughs> Don't be dumb. 
Don't let your fireworks not tonight, next year. <laughs> Social distance so that next year we can all be celebrating together. And as close as possible. Yes. <laughs> like we were in Carnival, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys so much and we'll see you in the new year. Bye. Doi. I'm doing it. <laughs>